Hello there all you wonderful people, it's Matt from Geekstalgia here with yet another unboxing video for your viewing pleasure. And today on the channel we're opening up this, another addition to the Spider-Man collection. It is a turn of Scorpion from Hasbro Marvel Legends. So, let's not waste any more time. Let's free him from this plastic prison and see what we have inside. And here he is guys, Marvel's Scorpion from Hasbro's Marvel Legends Spider-Man 90s cartoon retro line. That was a mouthful. Let's take a closer look at the box before we tear it all open to get that figurey goodness inside. So on the front we have obviously the plastic window packaging. We've got the figure there. No accessories, just his massively long tail. Portrait of Scorpion on the side there. We've got the Spider-Man 90s logo at the top. On the back we have Again, another portrait of Scorpion. Uh, it says, possessing superhuman athleticism and a mechanical battle suit, the Scorpion is driven by his obsessive hatred for Spider-Man. Various warnings in different languages at the bottom. Not to free, but even if you're over free, don't be putting them in your mouth. We know this by now. You will choke. You will die. Don't do it. Just play and display. So, that's the box. Let's tear it open to get that figury goodness free. So now that he is free, let's take a closer look at the figure before we display him proudly on the shelf amongst his Spider-Man villain brethren. So, head sculpt, he's got a really cool expression on his face of, well, you can tell his hatred of Spider-Man is there. Can't see any sort of paint slips, loving the shade of greens we've got going on as well. Eyes, I mean, I don't know if it comes across on the camera, but looking him above the camera, I mean, looking into his eyes, he looks like he wants to kill me. So I'm going to say, yeah, good job on the eyes. Same sort of colour throughout that shade of greens we've got. As you can see, he does have a massively long tail, which will make putting him on the shelf interesting of where we can put him. You can see the little holes in there. So we do have a bendy white in the tail to get various poses and angles and designs. Articulation time, head goes all the way around, full on exorcist style. That's about as far as the head goes back to look up at the sky. That is as far as the head goes down to look down on Spider-Man. Arms go out to get that full on T-pose look. Rotation in the shoulder. Double elbow joint. Wristies go twisties. Wristies go a little bit up. Wristies go a little bit down. Twist at the ribs, but no sort of ab crunch to get some bending. We have a twist at the waist as well. Legs go out, legs go around. Double knee joint, shin twist. Ooh, ankles go up, ankles go down. Ankles go all the way around. Final thoughts on the figure, you won't be surprised to hear that I love it. I think he is fantastic. I love the color, I love this bendy tail to get all these different poses. I'm nearly there with all the Spider-Man villains I want. As always, I'm not gonna get Morland because Morland sucks. But as far as all the other figures that I do want, I am nearly there. But for this figure, I think he's fantastic and he will make a fine, fine addition to the collection. And there we go, guys. That's Hasbro's Marvel Legends Scorpion opened up, ready to join the ever-growing collection of Spider-Man figures on those top shelves behind me. As always, thank you so, so much for watching. If you want to do those wonderful YouTube things I'm supposed to remind you to do, like, share, comment, subscribe, please do. It's always massively appreciated when you do. But as always, I'm not going to hate you. If you don't, it's your choice. You do you. But until the next video, whatever it may be, whatever comes your way, thanks again for watching. Take care of yourselves. Take care of your fellow humans. And I hope to see you all again soon.